people. I just woke up and I'm going to talk about World of Warcraft today. No real reason. I haven't played it in about uh, three weeks, four weeks, something like that, about a month, I guess. Still have it installed, I just don't play it because my subscription ran out and I, I'm playing Darkfall right now. And I don't feel the need to play the two games at once. However, I would like to talk about Cataclysm because people are wondering what the fuck my opinion on Cataclysm is. Like it really matters, but I'm gonna tell you anyway because, well, what good am I? Well, let's start with my favorite expansion on that game was Burning Crusade. Um, actually, it was better than Vanilla in my opinion. A lot of people will disagree with that, but you know what? I'm going out there. I'm sticking my head out, man. I am a rebel and I am a maverick. I have all of the unpopular opinions, so that's just me. Wild, wacky, and crazy. Now let's get into Cataclysm. The biggest thing that oh god, people are home. The biggest thing that I noticed about Cataclysm is that uh what was the biggest thing I noticed about Cataclysm? See, here's, here's the thing, I have to think about this, because to me, it was just World of Warcraft again. Like, I didn't really notice much different about Burning Crusade to Wrath of the Lich King to Cataclysm from Vanilla. Like, it's all pretty much the same thing to me. I started off by making a mage, an undead mage, and I actually went through the leveling process from 1 to 60, which was revamped completely. And holy fuck, I think that was the best thing that Blizzard has ever done. I hope that they... Well, actually, I hope they don't remap a lot of um, the Burning Crusade stuff. Like, an Outland, all that quest line stuff. Because, I mean, I've... It'd be kind of a hit and miss thing for me, because I've done it about six, seven, eight times now. All the quests in Outlands I've done probably at least once. Except the ones in Shadowmoon Valley, which I avoid with my fucking life, because... That is the worst area in the game, hands down. Um, I When I first played Cataclysm, I leveled in Vashir. Vashir, I don't know how the fuck you say that. The water place. I leveled there. And I was convinced that that was the worst horrible place ever. In any game. Um, my friend Jenny was with me pretty much the whole time. And he said that he had the exact same uh, experience when he first started playing in that area. And, um, I can see why, because it was, it took a while to get used to. One thing that I, he said that was a hellhole was Vashir on launch day, because he got Cataclysm, like, I guess he was in line for the fucking game when it was released at, like, GameStop or something. So, he was in line, he bought it, and he got home, and he went to Vash, apparently, right away. And he said that swimming around, doing the quest line, trying to fucking steal a mob from somebody when they're all, you know, ranged assholes, like, you know, hunters just arcane shotting the fuck out of everything. That's another thing I didn't like about Cataclysm. Um, the hunter changes, I'm sure they are, they were good. I'm certain that they're good. I just don't really play my hunter anymore. I never really did play a hunter. I leveled one, and in fact, I was, I think, the third, or the f second. I wasn't the first. I was close to the first. I was the third or second Draenei Hunter on the server during, you know, Burning Crusade's launch to get a mount, so hit level 40. And I was pretty proud of that. Especially considering I actually logged off every once in a while. <laughs> the, the guy who actually did do it, I I don't remember his name for the life of me. Um, I remember I remember seeing him quite frequently, though, while I was leveling. And I, I just don't remember. But I do remember when I got my mount, he was sitting in the middle of Iron Forge with the, with the, with the elephant... And that was a big deal at the time, because nobody had an elephant yet. So, and they were pretty f huge, so, you know, everyone was, like, gawking at him, and I went to gr gr go grab mine, and he was already gone, and I had my elephant there. And I got, like, three tails. I'm certain he got, like, a hundred, but I got three, like, whoa, let's cool him out. You know, that was, that was when I was, like, 16, and I was desperate for attention. So, that's, the <laughs> not 16, that was about 15, actually. Which makes more sense. So I was desperate for attention on the internet, of course. And, uh, that's, that's that. Um, so the 1 to 60 thing was okay. I didn't mind that. Um, then we got to Outlands, and you could tell that it just kind of stops, you know? <laughs> like, 
they, they've they've kind of done their quest differently from the outset of uh, Cataclysm. Uh, Wrath was kind of the same thing. They they kind of you can tell that they're they're evolving their quest lines. Like you know, Vanilla started off kind of you know very bare bones, basic. You know, uh, go run across the entire map, kill something seventy times, collect four things on the other side of the map, and then go to the middle of the map and place them here, and then come back to me. You know, that kind of obscure thing that I actually like, but, uh, you know, I guess a lot of people complained, and it was a little bit too out there, so I, I can understand that. Um, Burning Crusade, they just kind of gave you very basic shit, like, run here, kill nine, come back, go back, kill nine more, come back, kind of shit. Um, I did like how they actually, you know, decided to put two or more quests in the same spot for once, that was nice. Um, and then in Wrath, I only played Wrath for like, you know, maybe combined three weeks. Not very much. Uh, so I, I can't really tell you much about the quest, I don't really remember much. Uh, the instances kind of sucked in Wrath. Uh, they, they, they suck even more now in Cataclysm, now that I think about it. I've only, I only did a few instances in Cataclysm. I don't me remember much about them, they were just loot hallways, that's all they are. Um, that's why I love Maradon so much. It's, I think it's the best like designed instance besides Stratholme. Uh, I did Stratholme again just to you know relive the old times, I guess. But Maradon, I think, is like just a beautiful fucking designed place. Um, I'm pretty sure it's gone now. I actually don't know. I didn't hit the, the duh, the, the, the Desolus. Yes, that's what it's called. Desolus. I didn't hit that. So, I don't know if it's still there. I wish it is. I hope it is. Rather. Um, yeah, loot hallways are not fun for me. I don't like going into an instance with a... And that's another thing. The, the looking for group thing. They, they actually put that back. So you could, like, randomize a group, which gets you more rewards. And I kind of like that for Battlegrounds. And Battlegrounds are actually the reason why I, there's no difference between anything any of the expansions, because I've only done really Battlegrounds, like, PvP has only been what I go on WoW for, because I love it. But, uh, the instances, they are... I can't say they're terrible, but they're not good. Um, the, the bosses are okay, they actually, you know, require some form of strategy now, but, you know, nine times out of ten, the strategy is just don't stand in the giant, heavily marked area, or you'll die. And that's not fun, like, uh, moving around. Okay, I can do that. I'm a mage. I can use Scorch and run around. I don't have to stand in one place to do damage anymore. I still think Burning Crusade reigns supreme um, for the PvP. Especially PvP, actually. Uh, there's no real other expansion that has, you know, come close to the way... how Just how, how mainstream and, and, you know, amazing the PvP was in Burning Crusade. Although, you know... There were the things called welfare epics back then, I believe it was still Burning Crusade, where you could farm up some honor, go to the honor guy, and get yourself an epic. That was when they started handing out epics like crazy. In Cataclysm, they actually make you work for them, but really, they only add like three more stats into the exact same item anyway. So, it's no big deal to get ep epics anymore. Uh, that's, that's something I'm going to elaborate on a little bit. Basically, uh, I'm I'm pretty sure it's like this in PvE as well. I looked it up, and they pretty much look the same. They are the same. They're just the same items. They're just recolored. Um, remember in Vanilla, when you had a bunch of blues and greens, and you went to Molten Core, and you got, like, this big-ass fucking crazy shoulder guard thing? That was awesome. And you got, like, okay, I look I look great now, okay? I'm, my character looks awesome. In this game, every character looks the same. In Cataclysm, everyone looks the same. Everybody either has... Actually, everybody does have all of the Blue Honor PvP s stuff. You know, like... Um, everybody has that. Because it's, it's especially as, as Horde, it's pretty easy to farm up some Honor. Um, so, that's another thing. This, this, this Undead Mage that I leveled was my first ever Horde main. Um, in, like, five years of playing, I have first time I ever played a Horde, like, actually level-capped. And, uh, even though the queue for getting into Battlegrounds took way longer than on my home server as Alliance, you know, my home server took maybe a minute, two minutes to get in. On this server, it took an average of eight minutes to get into a Battleground. And I still had the most excess of honor. I couldn't even believe it. Like, I didn't know what to do with all the honor I had anymore. With my dwarf, my stupid 
shitty healing dwarf guy who I don't care about really. I hate healing so much. And I just don't like paladins anymore. They just they're just not good anymore. I just they're not it's not that they're not good. I like to play classes that, you know, aren't considered horribly overpowered by everyone's standards. It's just I don't find them entertaining or fun anymore. You might as well just play a death knight because they're pretty much the same thing. They just do more damage. Well, anyway, with this expansion, I do realize the the fun in WoW. I've all, I've always realized the fun in WoW, but this is the first expansion that really made me realize what that is, <laughs> what what it really boils down to. It really just boils down to my numbers are bigger than your numbers, so I win. You know, and and heals have always pissed me off. I've I've always hated healing, and uh, I kind of like the change that they did with healing, where they made every heal cost a dick ton of mana. But all you really have to do is build a bunch of spirit, and then bam, suddenly you can spam a bunch of heals again, and it's not really that big of a deal. Um, you know, healing has always pissed me off in WoW, especially in arenas, because I was never really a good healer myself, because I was a paladin, and I didn't really know how to play a paladin back then. And uh, I've never been a good healer today, because I don't know how to build right, because you have to build a specific way to heal the most efficiently. Basically, it's, it's all just, you know, cookie cutter. Do you want to build a healing paladin? Well, you gotta you build a bunch of this to be efficient in PvP. Do you want to be a fucking PvE fire mage? Well, you gotta have a good rotation. You know, it's basically all just, you know, set in stone already. You just have to, you know, fill yourself in as clay. And then suddenly, you're that. So, it's 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 kind of just not fun anymore for me. Uh, I do, it's, it's fun for me to play, like, just occasionally, but I'm never, ever, I don't ever see myself doing to, yes, I said that Canadian, I don't ever, ever see myself s playing WoW for, like, five months at a time again, like, I think that's done. It, it's good for me to, you know, just p kill time with, because I do like PvP way too much to give that up, but, eh, I'm, I'm ready to give up the main part of WoW now. So yeah, that's my opinion on Cataclysm. Doesn't really hold a candle to Burning Crusade, but it's okay. It's way better than Wrath.